Follow me on my journey with this van as I pack it time and time again with my photo booth, bartending, and rental businesses. <laughs> Okay, so you've seen my other four booths. This is my fifth booth, or the first one that I had built. So this is number one, not number five, technically. Uh, so it's just made of uh, cedar, and then it's just stained with a uh, hazelnut stain. And uh, yeah, it's got a, um, an all-in-one i5 Acer Inspire in it. Um, this is just one of my photo booth printers, DNP RX1 HS. Um, I've got a, just a LS, I think it's a 150 watt uh, mono light strobe on this one. So let's go around to the back. It's just open right now. So that's a opening and closing door. So if you look, there's just, um, here's the computer here. So uh, Acer Aspire all-in-one i5 and then uh, it's got a little fan here so that it blows the air um, out. And uh, this one doesn't come with um, a plug-in battery. So we've got batteries that we just constantly recharge on it. And uh, there's the little Wi-Fi stick there. And then one hooks into the camera, one hooks into the printer and everything is hooked into the surge protector. So uh, plug the computer and the uh, printer into the same surge protector. That's what the manual says. So sticking with it. Uh, camera up here, Canon T5. Um, yep. And then there's a, a little hot shoe on top that uh, hooks the Canon cameras to the flashes on this model of camera. So it's a PC sync cord hot shoe that's on there. So that hooks to the flash. Um, if you see the camera settings, uh, that's what the camera's set at. Manual, um, aperture is at f5.6, the ISO is 400. Um, yeah, so that's the booth back here. This little door here kind of keeps the computer locked in and then you see on this side that it just screws it unscrews right there and it just swings open so that's uh that's it there's a little compartment here this is just for uh when we're transporting the screen we just put that in front of the screen so it doesn't get banged in transport yeah so one important thing to remember is uh when you're plugging in the usb drive of your printer always plug it back into the same one or it will create um, different printers within your DSLR booth program and uh, it'll get confusing so uh, just don't do that if you have any more questions about that you can ask me in the comments so uh, we're just going to take it for a little run get ready make sure that it works prop kit there 50 piece prop kit with some cool christmas props and so it's going to take one more there and then we're going to send one to ourselves and we're going to uh, say cheese text one to ourselves as well so perfect So this one carries an older version of DSLR booth. I haven't had the time to update it. So we'll try and print one and should be printing. There we go. So printing will take about 10 seconds, uh, 10 to 13 seconds. We'll just wait there actually. So there's the, uh, the photo strips looking good for, for tonight's event. There's a little Christmas background. And then you can scan the QR code with your iPhone camera and the pictures will pop up that way. Or you can email the pictures. Um, and then 
can go back in, be like, ooh, I like that one. And then text that one to yourself. Done. And I just want to show you um, about say cheese screens. So um, there's a point where right before they take the picture, the screen pops up, that's the say cheese screen. So if you see here, I've got, you know, like different uh, images, say cheese, say cheese, you know, cameras, and uh, say cheese, all sorts of things. We're gonna go with this one. So save, blow it up, and then let's start the photos. Get ready. And then you'll notice the say cheese screen. Cool, eh? So that is say cheese screens. Smile. On DSLR booth. One more time. Hey guys, it's very important that you sub to the channel so that you can stay updated with all of the photo booth stuff that I will be posting all the time. Thanks for watching.